Now, why do we use Lisp? Lisp expands to locator ID separation protocol. Fabric edge nodes means what? The SDA nodes that connects to the edge of the SDA fabric. So when I say fabric edge nodes now, I'm talking about these nodes, switch one, switch two, body basic in our So fabric edge node means these nodes connects the edge of the SDA fabric. The fabric edge nodes register the fact that the node can reach a given endpoint identifier into the list map server. The list map server keeps a data of EID, endpoint identifier, and R lock routing locator. This is the developer. So imagine we have switch one, switch three, and switch four. Okay. Switch three order R lock IP. R lock means routing locator. It is like your route ready in OSPF. OSPF we have something called route ready, right? The name of a router. Ademari Lisp or language like termed as R lock. EID na in the switch valiya. In the IP la in our reach pano mudiyu mo. That subnet is termed as EID. What is the endpoint identifier? Which means I can reach 10.1.3.0 slash 24 via whom? Via this guy. Ademari, I can reach 10.1.4.0 slash 24 via whom? Via in the IP. Okay. So, in the IP, you can see the IP. Normal, in normal OSF network, each router is going to maintain its own routing table, right? Right, each router will have its own routing table. If I have increased number of routing table, if a routing table is 1000 entries, the route processing will become slow, right? Because I have to find out the best path from 1000 entries. What if I have 1 lakh entries? You know, it's slow arrow. The processing speed. If I have 10 lakh entries, you know, it's slow arrow. Because the lookup is what takes more time to find out which path or which exit point I will take. If you list plan up on Ragana, the routing table is the move and center of Portra. Engaporana, that's called list map server. The list map server will maintain the routing table of switch one, switch three, and switch four. Apo, event is the So everyone will ask him only, he will help him to redirect the traffic towards him. So, routing table is not managed by my switch 3. So, switch 3 will not face any issue if any, even if I increase the size of routing table. Now, let's understand how the traffic flow works. Initially, switch 3, if I configure Lisp, when I go, I go to inform to Lisp map server, saying that, hey, Lisp map server, my name is 172.63.3. If you want to send traffic, to 10.1.3.0 24, send the traffic to me. Ablin Solro. Ademari, once I enable Lisp in switch 4, and now it will also go and tell Lisp map server saying that my name is 172.16.4.4. If you want to send traffic to 10.1.4.0, send it to me. Now it has the Routing information for two people. Imagine that switch one is receiving a packet which want to go to 10.1.3.1. Switch three ponoma, four ponoma, yard to the EAD 10.1.3.1. Then trigger 10.1.4.0. Apo, even to the information. Are you three mana? Even three other. Even up on one, switch one is also part of Lisp, right? Now, switch one will send traffic to Lisp map server asking, Hey, Lisp map server, there is somebody who want to talk to 10.1.3.1. Tell me to whom I will talk. Abdi make a pump. He will reply Panamata or name. He will not reply saying that, okay, talk to this one sound to sixteen three dot three. Abdi Solomata. Even a sevana, he will go and inform the actual R log guy. Switch three inform one. Yen I inform one one. There is someone who want to talk to ten dot one dot three dot one. If you still have disability, then 
you create a VX LAN tunnel with them. Abhinav Sora. If the end replay Panamatrana, what if replay Panamo the entry of Pochana Mother? Some network issue, cabling issue, Pochana. Another safety car, list map server will go and inform Switch 3, saying that there is someone who won't talk to you. If you still have reachability, then you create the VX LAN tunnel. Abhinav Sora. This is our list works.